channel my name is Araceli and I'm Daisy and we're the Hermanas Veranas so we thought we would make a quick like introduction video just to let you guys know a little bit about us and um, the reason why we kind of created our platform um, I'm 19 yeah I'm 19 sorry <laughs> I always forget I'm 19 and then my sister's um, 21 21 yeah Something else about us is that we both um, work and go to school. If you guys want to know what we do for not a living, but like what we do for now, it's uh, we're both CNAs. She Which is a at, nursing assistant, just in case you don't know what that is. Oh, well, yeah. Um, she works at a hospital, and I work at a facility. Uh, like a nursing home? Yeah. We both go to college as well, full-time. So we go to school full-time and work. Say like a little fact about you. A little fact about me is um, what you guys will see in the coming video is that I like to dance loco rico. Oh yeah. So we hope to make more videos so I can show you guys like what that is. Even though I feel like a lot of people know, but like they don't know. No. Yeah. You know what I'm <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> um, I used to dance too, but I stopped. Um, something about me is like I love learning and I love psychology, especially psychology and like self improvement type shit. Like that's my shit. That's up my alley. The purpose of our platform. Um, we never really made like an introduction video. Um, I feel like those are important because it helps state your purpose and helps keep you grounded. So but our, I feel like our platform is important because um, I feel like there is not a lot of rep representation of vegans in like the art community, which is like the Latino community. So I feel like a lot of the Latinos and stuff, like they hold on to the idea that being Mexican means that you have to like eat carne and like get so like, oh, if you don't eat carne, so, like, you're, what are you? You're not Mexican. Like, you know, but I feel like being Mexican it shouldn't it's not about just like the food that you eat which I mean I guess you could say yes but like not really it you plays a I'm big saying? role because culture wise the reason we say that is because when we first went vegan um, which we could also make a video about if you guys want to know about like why we went vegan and stuff like that just mm -hmm. leave a comment down below but um, a lot of I don't know if you got it there but you. I for sure got it a lot in high school especially from like people that weren't even my friends bro but like people just be out here saying shit but they would just tell me like how how can you even say you're Mexican if you don't even eat meat? Mm -hmm. And I would just be like, what? How does me not doing this diminish me being this? Like that is still a part of my identity and it's something I'm super proud of and I'm not gonna like stray away from that. But I think the reason like yeah it's true. Um, it's when people a lot of white vegan, that's what when people think of veganism they include it to it being something that's like just white people do or just like rich people can be vegan which in reality like when I went vegan I was like yo like the Mayans and the Aztecs like if we're trying to go back back they would not even eat like meat like that and like heavily processed foods and cheeses and dairy like all of this stuff they didn't even eat a lot of you know mm -hmm. so just some people would tell me that I'm like dude like educate yourself because if we think about history because of colonization that is literally why people eat like dairy and that shit's like heavily influenced in our diets now mm -hmm. but that's a whole other topic <laughs> but also for like what you're saying like um as you guys can see in some of our videos we do include like veganized um i guess like mexican food just so we can show like our community that you know you can still eat these like good bomb food you know you don't like just because you're vegan doesn't mean you're only gonna eat like zanahorias or like shit you know we have a lot of videos planned like um series wise to kind of educate not educate well yeah educate you guys and inspire oh, yeah. you guys to like cook Cause that's kind Look. of one of our ma that's one of our main um, purposes with our platforms is just to educate and empower people and to inspire them. Did I say that right? No. Just educate and like inspire you to to want to be a part of the vegan movement and to like break barriers and like break the stigma that like oh veganism is just for white people. Like no, honey boo boo, you don't have to shop at Sprouts and you don't have to shop at Whole Foods. You can shop at Walmart, at the Ramate, and like make yourself bomb vegan food at home. Mm -hmm. And also like equate it back to like our culture just because um, we don't want to erase that part of ourselves just because we're vegan. You know, like like I still want my cultura to be like a really big, it's a big part of our lives. And like, why would we diminish that just because we don't eat meat? Like, I don't know. It just, yeah. And also uh, like Shashu was mentioning about um, like white vegans. If you do go on YouTube and like look up um, like 
vegan uh, Mexicanos or something like literally there's no videos like okay you'll find like one and then like that youtuber will like not have uploaded in, like, yeah months. and we don't want to be like that we want to like show people that you know what i'm saying because like when we were vegan we we're like we, i don't know a lot of like mexican vegans you know what i'm saying dude when i first went vegan I, we were talking about this and i told her i would literally okay i first went vegan i didn't really think much about like do you know what year like, you went vegan i went vegan in 2016 it is now 2020 but um i went vegan in 2016 and um, when I first went vegan, I didn't really think much about like, oh, like I could just veganize food I already eat. I don't know why that didn't come as common sense, but you know, I was out here eating like salads and eating like real healthy sh stuff and you know, that's cool. Like, you know, it's, it's good for your health and whatnot. But there was a point in my vegan journey where I was like in the beginning, probably like a couple months in, I was like, okay, like I, I kind of miss eating the regular food, like enchiladas, that's my favorite. And like, mm -hmm like tacos and stuff like I, I miss that type of food because that's what I was used to that's what my mom cooks yeah you know and so I was like well maybe I could just look up a recipe so I'd go on YouTube and I'd look up like vegan Mexican food and like there really wasn't like a lot you know or or if there was videos it was white people trying Mexican food which you know that's cool there's nothing wrong with that but I don't know it's just I just didn't feel like represented and I, I di couldn't find any youtubers that were like Mexican guys I would legit get on YouTube every fucking day and look up <laughs> vegan Mexican vegan Mexican youtuber because I, I just like I, I just noticed that like the people I was surrounding myself with like on social media etc 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 were all like white people and I don't know man it just becomes hard to relate and it's just kind of like damn where are my people at you know what I'm saying like it is this really just like a white people thing and then having people say comments like that like oh you're not you're not mexican or... yeah it's just you really think about it and you're like damn am i not mexican like look at the people i'm watching you know yeah so dude legit i would get on youtube every single day and i could never find anybody if i did find someone like she said they they uploaded a couple videos but they stopped and i was like no like i love you upload videos yeah. <laughs> you know yeah. so we did find another we did find a youtuber the other day when we were looking yeah her name is um I don't know her name, but we'll, I, we could pop up her. Her name's Iram. That's we'll link her, her stuff is. down below. But I know that's her name, but I don't know like her exact like YouTube handle name. She has really cool videos. You guys should check her out. You guys should check her out. She's for just sure. starting, just like us. She has a lot of like um, cooking videos. I feel like that's what her like channel kind of revolves around. Yeah. Like again, we want vegan. We want to reclaim veganism and not make it white people thing. Like, and just to support our community. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, dude. Um. So the type of videos we're gonna make um definitely a recipe videos i feel like in the beginning we, we wanted to do that and we kind of strayed away from that as you guys can see like on our if you guys like look on our channel but we want to go back to like cooking this stuff again yeah. because like it's a new year and like i feel like for a period like all of 2019 we kind of like got straight away <laughs> straight away from cooking and kind of just like um how would you say like got caught up in like the whole like vegan fast food and like vegan junk food which i mean again that's fine if that's what you like that's what you like but like for us, like we, that's not what we wanted. Like we want to be able to cook more and save money because okay. like going out to eat all the time, bro, that's like a, you'll see it in your freaking bank account. Like, yes. You'll see how much it affects. So cooking videos, that's uh, definitely. Well, a lot of like li lifestyle type stuff, like self-improvement things. I don't know. Just because with like YouTube, um, I like using it as a way to like reflect. You can watch like your old videos and see how much you've grown. Mm -hmm. So you can see that through like our self care Sunday series, which we also have a lot of other series planned um, for the next coming months and stuff. But yeah, more like self improvement stuff and just like again like educating other people because veganism for me and I think for her as well was like the gateway to just like my self improvement journey and like bettering myself and hiring my consciousness which i know sounds crazy but like it really was honestly like it just it just showed me that like damn i'm really capable of like changing my diet guys we used to eat meat literally every freaking meal <laughs> and guess what i mean yeah dude like we used to call her a mouse bro because she would literally eat cheese all the time yeah. so it's just know. like if we can change our diet like you can anybody can like, going back to when she first said she used to eat like salads and stuff um that's what we kind of not eat salads but like eat healthier because before yeah. like we didn't eat a lot of the processed vegan foods uh, like the processed meats one because they weren't even available like we the closest store we have to us is like united market oh my god they're not gonna sell anything vegan there besides like they now started selling like vegan milk they might have other stuff i haven't been there in a while and walmart those are the two stores where we shop at and walmart had no vegan options honey boo boo like 
anything, like bare, like the veggies, basically, like the stuff that's and they all milk vegan and milk, yeah, like plant based milk. But other than that, like now they have like no. the sandwich meat. Um, they have the hella gardine. So I think it's easy to get caught up in like, oh, like look at this stuff and like yeah. trying it out. That's kind of what happened to us. The other day we went to Sprouts and bro, I wanted to grab everything because there was like literally anything you could think of. It was it was there and it was vegan. Something else we want to talk about though, like in our channel, which you've seen in our grocery grabs, which is another reason why we started that series because we want to show you that like you can shop vegan like at all of these different stores. Like, obviously, it's harder like if you live in a food desert and stuff, but. We just want to show you that again you, if you're vegan you don't have to grocery shop or do all your shopping at whole foods because like for that's us expensive one that's expensive <laughs> really yeah expensive. dude and like whole foods and sprouts all those like trader joe's all those stores they're really far from us like they're a good like 30 to 40 minute drive yeah. um and then again it's just like it's not it's just it doesn't make sense it's not accessible to us to go all the way over there to grocery shop when we have a store that's like five minutes away mm -hmm. two minutes away like walking distance you know mm -hmm. so yeah, man, we just want to, like, we just want to show how veganism can be accessible. That it, it doesn't have to be this, like, big, crazy, heavy change. Um, and with us, too, like, our veganism is super intersectional. Like, we're not like other people that are, like, super strict and, oh, if we see you doing something, we're going to become the vegan police. Like, no, that's what we want to, like. Yeah, I feel like we, when you we are, when vegans are like that, it strays people from not wanting like, to be yeah. vegan. You know what I'm saying? Like, we, like, everyone's on their own path, their own journey. Like, I remember when I first went vegan, um, at first I didn't cut out honey. Now I, I, we don't eat honey, but in the beginning I didn't because I was like, who cares? Why is that? Yeah, and sometimes I would like accidentally eat some stuff, but like I didn't know, and it's like it's okay. It's a little, sometimes even right now, like that's just still happens. Yeah, because like, people don't people sometimes don't understand exactly what veganism is until you're like, wait, this doesn't have this in it, right? And then they're like, oh wait, that's not vegan. So it's still <laughs> kind of like a lot of people are still kind of confused about what exactly veganism is. But yeah, with our videos and like with our platform, like we just want to reach more people and just like have people engage. We want to create a community. You know, we want this to be very, like, community-based. We don't want... We're not trying to become, like, idolized by people and being, yeah. like, all, like... It's not even about that. It's just about, like, educating and, also, and bringing more people mm, to, like... And also speak. for, like, uh, um, our friends and stuff. You know what I'm saying? Like, they can watch our videos. Because I know a lot of people, like... Um, we're not really the ones to, like, bring up, like, oh, you guys should go vegan. Like, people usually ask us because, like, usually they tell, like, if we go out to eat and we can't get something, like, they're like, oh, what the heck? They ask us questions, so now, like... Not saying that we get tired of like because we'll answer your questions, but like just you can go back to our videos and like you know learn <laughs> instead of like asking the dad. No, yeah, we also wanted to um, challenge ourselves. What we're gonna be doing in future upcoming videos is to make videos in Spanish, just because a lot of our family doesn't really no most of our family doesn't talk English. Like mm -hmm. they'll understand a little bit of it, yeah. But some of them watch our videos and just to like educate them and that way they can better understand why we're why we even do this. Because a lot of times they ask us, why, why, like, why, why not just eat meat? <laughs> yeah. I don't, I don't get it. And it's just like, well, watch our videos like that. Like through our videos, you'll see why it is that we choose this lifestyle. Because it is a lifestyle. Um, so it's yeah. It <laughs> yeah, does. it's not a diet. It's a lifestyle. And also, um, so they can like follow our recipes. I don't know. They want to make yeah, us something. Yeah, man. <laughs> <laughs> or they want to make themselves something, like something healthy. Like a lot of our family, um... Has like diabetes and stuff. Actually, almost like everyone on my dad's side, especially, yeah, has like diabetes, diabetes and stuff. Cholesterol, high cholesterol, blood pressure. high blood pressure, all the, all the cholesterols. Just like all, all the, the highs. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what I'm saying. And like, we don't want to like, we don't want to, we don't want to keep that shit going, cause like, cause it passes down through like generation and yeah, generation and generation. Which is what through food, girl. Through food, yeah. <laughs> it's not even through genetic. I mean, it might be through genetics too, but. Oh, yeah, so with the whole, th how we said that um, our veganism is, like, intersectional, but what we mean by that is, like, intersectionals, think of it kind of, like, as a crossroads. Um, there's, like, multiple things that aid in a person's identity or how it is that they identify mm -hmm. as. So, for us, we are Mexican. We are women. We're Mexican. Um, we are... How did you say? More... <laughs> We're young, I don't know. We're young, you know, we're in school, we're... Basically just to showcase like every single part of our life, I guess. Just to say. showcase, yeah, all the parts of our life and like, I'm sure like people can relate to one part of us or another. Um, um, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
Yeah, that's pretty much the point of our platform, and it's like everything pretty much is gonna revolve around veganism. But like, pretty much, yes. Um, we hope that you guys um enjoy our channel, and you guys enjoyed this video, kind of got to know us a little bit. Later on, maybe we'll do like an in-depth Q and A, but honestly, not right now because I feel like no one will ask us questions. <laughs> <laughs> but like later on, like we can ask you guys questions, like whatever you guys wanna know, like we'll answer. Yeah. Don't be scared to DM us, bro. Like, really? we're literally, we ain't shit. Like, we're just regular ass human beings who film videos and post them on the internet. Like, you know, you ever really think about that? <laughs> like, don't be afraid yeah. to, like, message us. Don't be also, afraid to like, ask questions. With this, we also wanted to make, like, more friends. You know what I'm saying? Like, reach more, reach other people, have people DM us so that we can be friends with them. The more people that are like us. Maybe. Just, like, connect with other people, you know? Human connection is so powerful, y'all. <laughs> like, that's something we want to create like once we expand you know and and grow this platform like see, we just want to see us get it but like with hard work and dedication anything is possible yeah but yeah we just want to like we said connect with other people and um yeah <laughs> i don't know what so else because i like what y'all see <laughs> um, kidding, oh also we never really oh. shout out our social medias but like we're saying if you dm us like our social media is always linked down below um, it's uh everything is less than one as veganas basically for like our um platform pages but like for our, our private pages not private pages but like yeah. our personal pages <laughs> don't, don't we link them <laughs> shut up we link them down below so um yeah i don't really ever get interaction just saying <laughs> okay well, i follow both of us our mm -hmm. links are down below and i'll put our our handle names right here instagram twitter <sighs> Mostly no. follow our last hermanas veganas though. This year, because I'm the one that's in charge of like our Instagram account, I do want to like with our channel. I didn't really know what, what I wanted to do with our Instagram either, so it's kind of like all over the place. But like now, I, I have an idea <laughs> of like how I want our Instagram page. Because of vision. It's because I don't want it to look like messy. Like I still want it to look like nice. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, expect nicer pictures. Cause just expect a lot more content, y'all. We have so many freaking ideas. We can't wait to like put them out, plan. Prepare and executing that is what we're doing stick to, to our plan. You know what I'm saying? Just leave a comment down below letting us know you what know, you guys think what you guys, guys want us to see Video suggestions suggestions for us like I don't know just anything like we're open to anything If you guys want to see more vlogs, we can do vlogs when we're doing like vegan activities Vegan <laughs> activities, <laughs> activities. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, But yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed this video um just a little it's introduction. The first Monday of 2020 is the time that we're filming this. We hope that you guys are achieving all your goals and doing things to better yourself, move, to move your towards your goals. Does that make sense? Yeah. So, yeah, we hope you guys enjoyed today's video and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.